Hey everybody, Justin Millet here. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can tell or not, but it's a little cold here. What's up everybody? Justin Millet with Aspire Realty Group here. We are four hours north of Anchorage. We are driving the Parks Highway on our way to Fairbanks, Alaska. We are headed to Chena Hot Springs today. So we're gonna be showing you the Ice Hotel, super sweet Aurora Borealis tour, as well as some of the coolest parts about Fairbanks, Alaska. Man, we just got to Chena Hot Springs. 8.5 hours of driving later. I'm ready to get off my butt. <laughs> my eyelashes are frozen. I can feel the condensation building up from the mask hitting my eyebrows and eyelashes. Okay, here we are. It's pretty crazy, the whole place is made of ice. Water now ice sculptures that have built this entire, you know, hotel slash castle <laughs> slash uh, wedding chapel. Obviously a world-class attraction. Hey everybody, Justin Millet with Aspire Realty Group. We are here in Fairbanks, Alaska. With me is Tyler Bogart, who is the local expert who will give us some inside information on what makes Fairbanks, Alaska so unique. Um, just, you know, for this video, for the, all of our viewers who just don't quite know what makes Fairbanks unique versus kind of the rest of Alaska, um, obviously it's kind of smack dab in the center of, center yep. of Alaska, yep. but kind of what are some of the, uh, the attractions that bring people to Fairbanks? I think the biggest thing for coming to Fairbanks is the history. The uniqueness of Fairbanks with history. There's, look around, there's buildings that have been here since the 20s. Right. Like it's still very historical. We haven't changed a lot. It's not very new. There's just right. history everywhere you look. Basically one of a kind tourist attraction in the world, mm -hmm. which is the Ice Hotel and then the Chena Hot Springs itself and mm -hmm. all their geothermal technology. So, yep, yep. Um, do you think that's kind of a large attraction too? Of the, of the I would say it's, yeah. I would say that is probably one of the number one reason we have a lot of tourism in the winter time. Okay. Who wouldn't want to go sit in a hot springs, take a nice warm dip and watch the Aurora Borealis? Right. All right, we're about to sign out. Justin's been out of your nice this year. Santa Claus House, the owner, the original owners, Con and Nellie Miller, okay, uh -huh. actually be in over seven or 60 years ago, founded Santa Claus House. And Con Miller was actually the one that brought the papers to um, Juno to get um, North Pole Incorporated as a city. Wow. Here we are. We are at uh, one of the museums here located in Fairbanks, Alaska. They are all pre-World War II vehicles, uh, automobiles, and then now they've added clothing. So um, stuff is over 120, 130 years old for some of these automobiles. And they all run, which is incredible. So let's uh, go ahead and take a tour.
What's everybody, Justin here. Obviously, we are in a old military, basically kind of like cat. So we are going to do a roar tour, minus 30 at the top of this mountain. Um, try and catch those elusive Northern Lights slash Aurora Borealis. We will see you guys at the top. three of our trip. Man, we had an incredible time last night at the top of Charlie Dome, which is a 30 minute cat ride up to the top of the mountain, just outside of Chino Hot Springs, with a lovely temperature of minus 30 degrees with wind chill. Um, man, it was cold. But we got some incredible footage of the Northern Lights last night. The weather cooperated with us, uh, the clouds dissipated, and uh, between the stars and neural lights, man, we got some amazing shots. So we also did a tour of the world famous ice museum. There's only a few of these, like I said, in the world. So we have one right here just outside of Fairbanks, Alaska. Um, so we did got an awesome tour of that. We even got to film them making one of their mar ice martini glasses, which is one of the cool little uh, tourist things they do for you during your your uh, ice hotel tour so just kind of an update we'll be heading back to anchorage on our eight and a half hour drive from china hot springs look it's a nice and clear day today it is currently minus 20 here at the resort i'm cold so i'm gonna get in the water And with that being said, if you guys enjoy our content and our videos, make sure to like, you know, share, subscribe. Uh, we're, you know, we have a YouTube channel as well. We'll, we'll uh, send you that information. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Drop us a like, drop us a share, hit that subscribe button, and we'll uh, see you around.